What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So today we wanted to do a review on the Pusha T Oswego Mystery Brown colorway. And we're just going to look at the shoe, look at it in detail and just kind of see what we like and dislike about it. All right. Stay tuned. So this is the Adidas Pusha T Oswego Mystery Brown colorway. As you can see, it's like three different browns with a, a gum bottom. It has the uh, lime accents throughout with the lime uh, three stripe Adidas stripes with a, like a lime core going all the way from the back of the shoe to the um, laces. Um, it's a real dope looking shoe. So this is just a closer look at them. Definitely a, a, a nice looking shoe. It has the mesh uh, upper with the leather tongue. Of course, they have the king push inside of where the sole is. You can see it. Let you know that's Pusher T's shoe. Nice padding on the back where the heel is with like suede um, accents up by the lace holes. It's a comfortable shoe, a nice cushion. Um, it came with the black pair of laces and, of course, the uh, neon laces. Also, the box was pretty simple, but it had the packaging of Pusher T on the um, box paper. But overall, it's just a dope-looking shoe. I think the lime laces go a lot better with the shoe uh, once you put them in versus the brown or black pair that they have. Um, but definitely a shoe you want to get if it's below retail. Um, I waited till the shoe dropped till it was closer to about uh, 80 to 90 dollars to purchase. I think the original release and the price was about 125. So I just kind of wait for these shoes. So let me know if you like them. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. We appreciate all the views. Thanks, y'all. Deuces.